So stay tuned and get ready for some deep stuff. Welcome back, everyone. Oh my gosh. <laughs> it's been a while. It has been probably a year since I've actually filmed anything. Wow. Now here's the thing, I am so nasally, my nose is so blocked, hence the video, and my bird bit me there, which was so amazing. I think I did a head in and she kind of got over it. Anyway, <laughs> we're going through some technical issues. My nose is super crusty. As you can see, crusty, crusty. So I was like, okay, I can't be the only one that is having a crusty nose in winter. I think it's autumn actually, in autumn in Australia, in Sydney. So how are we gonna do, what are we gonna do about that? I wanna show you guys how I would wear makeup on top of this beautiful little debacle where it doesn't look like it's crusty and you don't look completely crazy. Even though you're not crazy, but you know what I mean. Okay, shall we continue? Yes, we shall. Step one, this is the most important step ever, 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 Vaseline. I like to get a little bit on my finger. Now, I have gotten this up my nose a few times. You don't understand how incredible this feels. So you really just wanna make sure that's everywhere around your nose. I usually just like put it on my lips too. <laughs> After that's on, I like to wait about five to 10 minutes for it to really absorb in, let it set, let it do what it's gotta do before we move on to the second stage. So, let's put it on for six minutes, okay? Okay, so it has been six minutes. Oh, I repeated it, oopsie. Okay, so the next step I would recommend, what I, what I do, is I like to mix my cream and foundation together, so I'll show you what I mean. So I put like, I'm just gonna put one pump. And then we're gonna mix it together. After I've mixed them together, I like to take the smallest amount, and I'm just gonna start with my nose because you know, <laughs> I also sometimes like to use a little brush. So now when I get to this section, I want the least amount of product. So I kind of just want to spread it all around. Okay. Now when I get to this section, okay. I'm gonna get a little bit of, on the product, take it off on the back of my hand, and I start with my lip, and I'm just really tapping that very lightly. The least amount of product, because the more you put on, one, it's gonna get itchy, and two, it's gonna look creepy. We don't want creepy. So that is it. I'll do the rest of my makeup and come back just to show you the final look, but you can see, it looks so good already. All right, my loves, this is the final result. As you can see, we are still good to go under the crispy crust aspect. O obviously this little thing didn't get covered up, but I didn't really want to cover it up because it's still really what is fresh. Really changing, so Apologies. But yeah, I just wanted to show you the final result and to show you that you can still cover your crispy nose even if that's why. Better. But yeah, I just wanted to show you the final result, my loves, and to show you that this has been on for about an hour now and it's still good to go. Obviously, if you blow your nose, get ready for some, some stuff. But that's why you carry a little kit in your car or in your bag or something, right? Just a little touch-up stuff. Thank you, my loves, so much for watching. I am so excited to be posting again. Let me know what you want to see next. I will see you in my next video, so... Stay tuned and get ready for some deep stuff, but also about learning and having fun because that's what life's about. Bye.